To hear critics clamoring about what Barack Obama calls an economic recovery plan, you'd think it was some kind of horror movie. It is a monster in size, at least, costing almost as much as what the government takes in from income taxes for a full year. $275 billion for tax cuts. $87 billion for Medicaid. $140 billion for education. Over $100 billion for alternative and renewable energy. Obama's getting it from both sides. From the left, they want a new New Deal, more spending on long-term infrastructure projects. On the right, they want more tax cuts so people can stimulate themselves. Part of the president's problem is trying to split the difference between the warring sides. But he's pursuing this compromise, believing it'll create or save millions of jobs. If that happens, it'll be more Jekyll than Hyde. If not, it'll be his hide. Ah!